Okay, good everyone. Welcome to another graphics class. Today what I'm going to do is show you how to set up the border of your page. Now I am going to use a um, fine liner, but it's a 0.6, which I would never usually use for my drawings. But I'm going to show you this so that you can see um, how the lines that I'm drawing. So I've already established that I've set up my paper with my T-square on my board and that's horizontal and lined up ready to go. And I'm going to use the side ruler to measure 10, centimet 10 millimeters down. If you don't have that, then you can just use um, a ruler to measure your 10 millimeters. Now it also has to go 10 millimeters in from the edge of the page. So I'm going to go all the way across. Bring that down. Use the bottom of my T-square and measure 10 up and 10 across. Then I'm going to use my set square that's going to come into play and it's 10 millimeters in from the edge of the page. And what I'll do is once I've done this, I'll actually take a photo of the page um, with everything written on so you can have that in front of you as well and not just have to watch me draw it up every time. So today we're using an A3 piece of paper and the A3 paper is positioned in a landscape format. So the next thing we have to do is measure 10 mils up again and then 10 mils in. So 10 up and then 10 in. I'm just going to put a little dot there and then 10 up and then 10 in. And that line's going to go all the way across the page. And then what we're doing is we're getting set up for a title bar. It has to go um, 13 up. So I'm looking at my ruler on my board. 10, 13, 10 in. All the way across. And then I can close that with my set square again. Now the reason I had 13 there is because we're actually going to put in our um, lettering, so naming what our piece is in the title bar. So that comes three millimeters down. And I'm using a pencil this time. And then seven. And then that is where all our lettering is gonna go. So now that I've um, got that border on and I've started to put the title block in there, the next one is um, measuring out how far the distance for the name, the title of your piece, etc. Okay, so the first one is we're going to measure 10 across and that's going to have our student name. Then we're going to measure 8 across and in here is going to be our class. We're going to measure another 10, which is going to be our title of our drawing. And then this 8 is the date that your piece is completed. So I'm just going to put my T-square and my set square together. Use my marker and make sure that those lines are nice and vertical and so that you can see them. Now, lettering is something that you need to factor in as well. When you're doing your lettering on your drawing, you need to make sure you're using capital letters. There's no ifs or buts or maybes. You need to use capital letters. And that goes between the three, the seven and the three millimeters. So in here is our student name. And then the next one is our class. The next one is the title of the drawing. So here we're looking at our um, page layout. And 
and this is called our title bar. And in the last one, we put the date that it's completed. Okay, that's it for our page layout. And I'll just put some um, information on this so that you can have a copy of this in your books.